so but that's fine I uh, to explore this the cave system I need to go back to the beginning anyways there's been a lot of accidents today so we are going back to the Ashton project and hopefully no not the Ashton Amber Quinn but let's first see what what everything was that we found okay so I've missed something at uh, escape part 2 which isn't surprising because uh, one of three Nomai escape pods that crashed in our solar system is talking about escape pod 2. All three escape pods were launched from something called the vessel, which was badly damaged. Uh, the Sunless City. The Nomai survivors who crashed on Amber Twin decided to seek shelter in the caves beneath the crashed escape pod. The Nomai discovered a promising long-term shelter site at the end of one of the passages beneath, beneath this escape pod. Chert thinks the lack of surface wounds means that the Nomai must have lived somewhere underground. There is a path leading to the high energy lab from Sunless City. Okay, look. And this is also new. High energy lab. The negative time interval measured at Whitewall Station was further investigated at the high energy lab in the canyon, canyon at Amber Twins Equator. The high energy lab can only be accessed by a path from the Sunless City. Oops. Okay, yeah. So we will go back and do just that. Get to the high energy lab. And I am way too fast. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Almost died there. Uh, the planets are way closer than you think sometimes. So. Oh boy, boy. Don't run into me, please, sir. Yeah, I also had no uh, control at all. Because I was... Don't crash. Perfect. I couldn't have gone any better. Okay, let's get to the escape pod. Where is the escape pod? There's a... Locator device. Currently not looking for that. The shuttle thing in the trigger. I wasn't looking for that, but I'm very interested now. I think you can and you can probably get to through the tunnels from anywhere to anywhere on this planet. I would assume. Ouch. Get down there. Well, that thing is damaged. So that's maybe the reason why the shuttle doesn't go on. Maybe the reason why the shuttle only has one place to go. Activate gravity cannon. Call shuttle home. We'll see what happens, but I don't think it will go well. Oh, it doesn't care. Okay. Okay, let's see. Why is the shuttle frozen on the outside? I fear our situa situation may be dire. 
Pi Poke and I landed here uh, on this comet not long after its arrival in our star system. Our shuttle's equipment heard strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Pi and Poke were able to locate a fissure in the, uh, the ice on the comet's sunward side, and they descended inside to investigate the source of the readings. But Pi and my sister have been gone for a long time now. They haven't contracted, contacted me since descending below the surface either. Should I leave the shuttle to look for them? Um, I want to follow proto protocol, but I don't know what I'll do if I, if they aren't well. Poke, Pi, come back to me safely, my friends. Oh, I was reading this. I wasn't reading this for me. So let's see where we can go with this shuttle. Okay, so middle does nothing. Okay, middle does nothing. That takes us into space. That, that does nothing. Does middle do something now? Yeah, it just takes us back. Okay, so that guy actually died in here. I don't know, I think I'm doing something wrong with the shuttles. Are you flying me to the sun, shuttle? No. Yeah. Yeah, so those things don't do anything that I can see right now. Maybe we'll get more information on how to use them later. Nope, I didn't want to do that. But this thing is definitely damaged a little bit. Because it's supposed to stand on those struts and not. Or maybe not. Oh, fall over. What do I do? Sunless City. That's where we want to go. Is there anything else to find here? I don't think so. Wait, can I? What happens if I close this while I'm in here? Nothing. No, oh, that's not good. Can't go through there. That is unfortunate. Okay, so we have to go to the Sunless City from some other way. question is how do I get out of here so I don't know how to do that oh no guess I'll just use the shuttle to get into space and then just jump out oh that was a terrible terrible idea And I need to catch up to the shovel. Can I do it? I can. Okay, so let's teleport back to where we came from. And find a way to get out of here. I found a way. Who would have thought it would be this easy? 
Let's get back to this is the wrong way. So we need to go left here. What's this? It's a window to the Sunless City. That's cool. Wasted a little bit too much time. But it'll be fine. Okay, we don't want to go there. We want to go here. Oh, we don't want to waste any more uh, fuel. Oh, I have very little fuel, actually. Where's my ship? It's very far away. That's not good. Wasted way too much time already. Um, I don't think there's. Uh, well, I don't think I can go without filling up. I think about it, but that's not that difficult because I can just fill up here. I think. No, that's not the right one. Damn it. Okay. This planet sometimes and only sometimes has a moon. This is also of note. It disappears if no one is watching it. Isn't that a fascinating orbital correct characteristic? Burr, I found your note, Mallory. Kindly count me among the moon's admirers. What is happening when it when it disappears? I doubt it ceases to exist. Does it move to another location? I believe so. Not only does the moon appear around Brittle Hollow, I can confirm it sometimes orbits Timber Hearth as well. This is my first time encountering a natural satellite with the ability to vanish when not being watched. We should study it, or even better, we should travel there. Anona, giving its reluctance to move while consciously observed, it might be a form of uh, macroscopic quantum mechanics. I agree. Our first step would be determining a method to track this quantum moon so that we can always know where it is. But they did exactly the same thing that their friends did. Okay, so this tracks that. This is probably the sun? No, I'm not sure. So where's, which one is the quantum moon? I think that must be the quantum moon, right? Yeah, it's that's the quantum moon, because if I look away, it's just... Yeah. So um, now it's there and I can see it. Very interesting. Can I get it to come here? I can't. I see it. Well, anyways, that's very interesting and all. That's exactly what their friends did on at Brittle Hollow. Church research notes. Proper property of church. Nearly the Nomai have been. Uh, ne clearly, the Nomai were making astronomical observ observations here. They chose an excellent spot. What is this big rotating device for? What was it the Nomai were observing? I'd posit there's something special about the orange symbol in this device. 
Hal and the new astronomers translator tool should be uh, nice to have, would be nice to have handy about now. So if we have a scroll. Oh yes, I like that. Where does the scroll go? Still don't know why I would need to doze off. Can I take out the scroll? The quantum moon locator is functioning. We have markers for each of the places the moon goes. No, no. Burr, I just uh, observed the quantum moon in its orbit around Dark Bramble. Burr, I added a marker for Dark Bramble. I thought the locator now accounted for all of the Phantom Moon's location, but sometimes the locator can't tell where the moon is. Perhaps there's a problem with the device? So that means that when the moon disappears, it is going around the eye of the universe, probably, because this locator behaves very similarly to the locate the other locator, the other Mamai tribe built, or the others built, in Brittle Hollow. And they were looking for the eye of the universe. Uh, Malore. It's also possible there exists a, th a sixth place in the star system which the Phantom Moon travels. You have a key. You have keen eyes, my friend. It's from this Phantom Moon in orbit around Dark Bramble. You have queen, keen eyes, my friend. Um, so this moon travels to a, a total of five locations, not four. It's actually six then. Okay, I want to go back to where I just was. Question is, where is that? I think it's in this direction. Oh, ship. Nope, it's definitely not in this direction. Let's just use the ship to get there. Show everything. Um, I'll check the ship, the ship log on the next um, cycle. It was not crash into that thing. That's where that guy sits. That wasn't a very good landing there. Oh, we're already too late again. So I'll just explore this a little further. I don't know where I can actually put this so it doesn't. Where I can put my ship so it doesn't get teleported. I guess it doesn't matter because I can just uh, jump in the sand as well. Good to get in here. Okay, I could. Oh, there's a dead guy here multiple dead guys here. This goes to here. Right. Should be teleporting me. It isn't though. Now it is. That's weird. Oh, we're somewhere else entirely. Okay. Charge, step onto the warp platform. 
departure time, arrival time. Oh yeah, it shows that the arrival time is before the departure time. I think I, we're on the mask. Are we not? I think we're on the mask uh, thing. And I think I've um, explored everything here on the on this island at least. I can't get up there, fortunately. I shouldn't be wasting my fuel. Although I don't know if it matters at all. Okay, so let's get back to this and maybe find out why these people are dead or these Nomai are dead. I can't tell. Why are you dead? What happened to you? Who hurt you? There it is. Don't teleport me. Okay, so this is just a way to get up there, I guess. Okay, interesting, interesting. Uh, that's not what I want to see. Ouch. Can I not get into this one? I can, just need to be higher up. Uh, the marble is missing. So these are all just teleporters to somewhere or another. It's very interesting. So the gravity is now really low. See where this one goes. Oh, huh. so there's a scroll here. Now we need to find a scroll hole. How do we get down there? Probably through here. If I need to guess. Let's first put the scroll in here. Hi, friends visiting from the hanging city here. Uh, uh, no, friends visiting from the hanging city. We are planning the Astron project at the high energy lab on Amber's twin equator. On the Amber's twin equator, I became lost on Amber twin. My gratitude that Rami found me at the high energy lab is the building with the large solar panels. I'm surprised I didn't see it. I imagine our otherwise immensely clever Konoi would lose his own head if we weren't anatomic if it weren't anatomically impossible. Okay, so this probably goes to the hanging city. Nope, that just goes to Ash Twin uh, to Wait, where is that? Oh, okay. So we can just teleport between the two if we want to. There's so many dead Nomai here. Crazy. This goes... This should go to the Hang City. Is that correct? We will see. It's not Timber Hearth. I don't see any um, Hello Mr. Sun. I don't see any supernova in the sky. Okay, so maybe this is broken, it doesn't work anymore. 
and was supposed to go to Tinderith. Maybe it just goes here. Okay, no. No, it doesn't seem to work. It's unfortunate. Okay. Next. I don't remember what direction we came from. Okay, so this is the core of the planet. That means that there's... That's where the masks are hidden. But it's supposed to be sealed, so I don't think we can find a way in without... There's so little, uh, so little gravity. Um, I don't think there's a way to get in there this way. I think you need to do it. Oh god. In a different way. Yeah, please land. Oh yeah, I've been up here before. It's time to die. Oh well, it looks really cool with the planets going into the supernovae. 